Once we have exited out of any menu you might have been in, you'll be back in this multi-view screen. If we right-click and bring up the menu options, let's go down to Multi. If you only have four cameras instead of eight, you can select channel one through four and your multi-screen will now just show the four screens in use. Once we have exited out of the multi-screen, we can right-click again and go to Color. Different lighting and other factors can cause the color to wash out or become overbearing. So here, you can select the channel that you want to adjust and tweak the brightness, hue, saturation, and sharpness until you like what you see. Then right-click to exit out of the menu. Once we have exited out of the color, we right-click on top of any picture we want and go to Easy Zoom. With this feature, you can simply point the mouse to something in the picture you want to examine more closely, left-click, and that portion of the screen instantly enlarges. Left-click to unzoom, right-click to exit out of the menu. Next, we'll talk about Snapshot. If you see something happening on a camera that you'd like a still of, right-click on the image, then left-click on Snap, and the DVR will capture a still for you. Similar to Snapshot, if you see something on a camera that you want to record right now, even if Motion hasn't set the camera in to record, just right-click on the image, left-click on the record icon, and you're rolling. If you right-click on the image again, you can left-click on Stop Recording, and the system will stop recording. To watch those recordings back, right-click over the camera image and scroll down to Playback. You can then hit Play or scan through the footage with the scroll bar at the bottom. Left-click the icon in the corner to exit playback mode. 